Um, it's pretty tough, especially considering at one point we were up by 15. Um, but I know I'm very grateful and blessed. And I just thank God for the opportunity I had to be able to play this long with these ladies and this coaching staff. Um, but I mean, it's definitely frustrating, definitely hurts, especially coming off for that loss and to Washington at that. But um, credit to Washington, played a good game and yeah. Um, second half a lot when they got offensive rebounds and then also they cut us up on the high low pretty, pretty bad and we didn't adjust quick enough. So kind of around that point, I think it was around 10, 11 minute mark, kind of slipped away from us. Jillian, how do you put this year you've had in perspective? Obviously 500 rebounds, 29 double doubles, go from four wins to 16, but obviously a very tough loss for you. Yeah, I don't really have words for it, except that it's been literally amazing, like from start to finish. So far, even though I've only had two years, this would be my favorite year because not only did I grow as a player, but I grew as a person and I became closer to players like Ariel and like my whole team. And like all around, I saw our team take a huge step from where we were last year. So if I could put this season into one word, I would, one word, I would absolutely say unbelievable. Coach Westhead say anything to you about your season? Not yet. Not yet. Hopefully, but not yet. Did you guys say anything to Coach Westhead after this win? No. He just he said his piece, and we just listened. Are you thinking you'll have more time to debrief in this, and this is your last night together as a group? Mm -hmm. Definitely. I think right now it's just a lot, and we are like. Still kind of, we have spring break, so everyone's kind of just figuring out what they want to do. But I think once we settle and really like grasp what's happened, we'll definitely we'll see each other again, including the coaches. What is playing for Paul for a couple years in Washington? It's a huge honor. Um, I was actually just thinking about that to have run the system and to have seen it work so many times, game in and game out. And to play for a coach like him who's play, coached NBA players, WNBA NBA players, won championships, it's probably one the highlight of my career. And I would consider him to be one of the best coaches I've had because he's taught me so much. And he's taught me ultimately to believe in myself and that I can be any kind of player I want to be. And I shouldn't settle for less. So it's been a great honor and a great pleasure. Do you see any stuff in the run for your class? Yeah. Uh <laughs> it's been a very up and down four years um, to be a part of a season where you're like the worst uh, Oregon women's basketball team ever to a team that finally goes back and makes it to some type of postseason was pretty cool. Um, as Jill kind of said, it's just kind of just it's been cool. Like it's one, of, it's actually probably one of the best seasons, that, best teams I've ever been on, best season for me by far. Um, how we've come together and how we've bonded on and off the court is, is just amazing to me and. Also, to be able to play under a legend like Coach Westhead is, is a great opportunity for me. So it was pretty cool. Do you have a particular moment with Coach Westhead that you'll remember for a long time? <laughs> um, um, maybe the first time I heard him say woohoo, because uh, <laughs> it caught us off guard, because um, he says in a very high pitched voice, like woohoo. Um, so I think, honestly, just the moments with him at practice. Uh, He's a pretty funny guy when he wants to be, when he's not, you know, ripping you. But like Jill said, he's he's a he's a really true player's coach. He definitely gives you confidence and makes you feel like you're the best player out there. You know, every shot's going in, keep shooting it. Um so it was it was definitely a great opportunity. I'm definitely blessed. Ariel, do you feel like the program just moved past Jillian and Shay right now? I don't know about Cache, no. Um no, they're both <laughs> IE products, they're, they're, they're great players. I'm, I'm definitely excited because I guess I'm an alumni now. Um, <laughs> I'm excited for what the future holds for Oregon women's basketball, like under Julian Aileen, because I know she's just going to get better, and especially Crache, like she's going to be a seasoned sophomore now. So it's, and also Alexi and all the different returning players, Caitlin. So it's going to be really good. It's just a matter of, you know, what coaching staff that gets to inherit these awesome players.
I know I am in college. <laughs> Thank you guys.